21st century is the best time to be alive. We got an intelligent toilet that coordinates your toilet business, a vertical takeoff Cadillac looking like a taxi from the fifth element, and even an Android that can walk, talk, and scare everyone around. Here are the techs that are so creepy, they're keeping tech experts and futurists awake at night. Toto Wellness Toilet Are you experiencing digestive distress? Soon enough, your toilet might be able to help. The Toto Wellness Toilet analyzes your stool to determine whether you're healthy. Its companion app then offers suggested dietary changes to improve your digestion. It's just a concept right now, but it could hit the next few years in consumer markets. 3D Body Scanning As a society, we're slowly adapting to the use of 3D body scanners, especially at airport security. But retailers are temporarily experimenting with body scanners as well. Amazon, for example, is testing it as a revolutionary way to custom-fit apparel you buy online. In times when social media companies are blamed for violating customers' privacy and banks are not immune from cyber attacks, well, it's no surprise that we worry about ways our exact body specifications can be abused online. If your personal data is available online, with the scan of your body, this can be a totally new level of creepiness. Kubo If you're having issues coping with loneliness amidst the pandemic, getting a pet can help. But if you're not ready to care for a living animal, the Kubo furry therapeutic robot is probably the new best thing. But there's one creepy detail about it that might get you confused. Designed to give you the same type of joy as a real animal, the Kubo doesn't have a head. Well, at least it has a tail that wags in response to your affection. Smart Baby Monitors It's a part of the rising Internet of Things, and there are many parents who welcome them because they allow you to hear, see, and talk to your baby from any place in the house. But smart sometimes seems synonymous with hackable, and we've already seen hackers gain access to intelligent monitors, like one incredibly creepy case in which a stranger threatened to kidnap a family's baby, and it can get worse. Someone talking to your child and asking them to open a door or a window or go to a particular place is truly the worst that could happen with this technology type. Ninu Smart Perfume our days, practically everything is smart and finally, your perfume or cologne is getting a high-tech upgrade too. Named as the world's first smart perfume, the Ninu works with an artificial intelligent powered app to let you produce a personalized fragrance blend with a few clicks. If you get tired of your regular scent or want to change it up for an exclusive occasion, you can easily do so in the app. The Ninu is only a prototype at the moment, but the company expects to start taking pre-orders the next month and kick off mass production in the second half of the year. GM Cadillac VTOL Vertical Takeoff and Landing Vehicle There's no lack of vehicle technology in 2021, but GM's futuristic electric flying taxi concept was the creepiest car we saw this year. The Cadillac Vertical Takeoff and Landing is a giant self-driving drone with four helicopter-like propellers. It offers transport to a single passenger at speeds up to 55 miles per hour. And GM is also creating a version with two seats. GM Cadillac hopes to one day use the vehicle as part of a zero-emission air taxi service. Pet Portal Pet doors aren't creepy, but a smart one that costs $3,000 is certainly out of the ordinary. If you're a dog owner with colossal money to burn and an eye for aesthetics, you might be excited to get the pet portal from MyQ. It opens with a custom collar sensor to open like an elevator, either automatically or by command when your dog wants to have a walk or come back in. It also lets you monitor your pups come and go from your phone in real time or on demand. You can pre-order it now with a $100 deposit, and it is slated to start shipping in limited quantities this spring. Razor Project Hazel N95 Mask Wearing a face mask is now the new casualty, but many CES 2021 vendors showed off high-tech pandemic-fighting face coverings with capabilities that extend beyond filtering germs. 
Benetton's mask phone can eliminate some of the muffles while you're talking on the phone. And the AirPop Active Plus can monitor your breathing and remind you when you need to change the filter. But Razer's mask, Project Hazel, is the weirdest and flashiest prototype you've ever seen. It features customizable lighting zones on every ventilator that can shine 16.8 million colors, making a gaming rig's aesthetics to your face. No idea on pricing or when it should hit the market. We'll be patiently waiting. Facial recognition. Internet-connected home devices are made up of lots of stuff, from lawn sprinklers to thermostats to vacuum cleaners. Even your attached bed can measure the status of your sleep. But it's the facial recognition-enabled technology that has left some feeling unsettled. The Google Nest Hub Max uses the display's front-facing camera not only as a security feature, but to show you related texts, photos, and other information when it recognizes your face. Google says it sometimes pulls facial data to the cloud to improve product experience, but it's not the only tech company that's saving your face or voice data. If you're allowing a device to record your face for any reason, it will surely end up in the cloud. Facial recognition has been picked as the future of all things, from advertising to law enforcement, but among its problems is accuracy. An ACLU study saw Amazon's facial recognition tool match 28 members of Congress with mug shots. Samsung bot handy. We can all use an extra hand to clean the house, and a new prototype robot from Samsung will cover the problem with the capability to pick up objects of varying shapes, sizes, and weights. This one-armed bot handy will assist with household chores, like sorting the dishes and tidying up messy rooms. It's even smart enough to use advanced artificial intelligence technology to differentiate the material of various objects, so it knows how much power to use when picking something up. Robotic Animals while fictional androids from films like Terminator and Alien have trained us to fear humanoid machines, some of today's creepiest robots are modeled after animals. Boston Dynamics has been in viral robot videos for years. Today, the company is famous for bringing its terrifying creations to the real world. A four-legged, dog-like robot spot is now available for sale. If a robot dog is considered creepy, other newborn machines take after more loathsome creatures. Scientists created a tiny cockroach-like robot with a similar ability to survive being stepped on. Among its applications, the tiny robot's toughness and speed could make it ideal for search and rescue after an earthquake. In Japan, scientists have created a snake-like robot for the same operations. Japan's Humanoid Android Talking about Japan, the National Science Museum is no stranger to eerily human androids. It's already employing two in its new exhibition hall. But what caught our attention is the newest colleague, called Alter. It has a human-like face of Professor Ishiguro's geminoids, but goes one step further with a rooted neural network that allows it to move. The technology powering involves 42 pneumatic actuators and, most importantly, a central pattern generator. That CBG has a neural network that replaces neurons, allowing the robot to create movement patterns of its own, controlled by sensors that detect proximity, temperature, and for some reason, humidity. The setup doesn't make for human-like movement, but it gives the viewer the extraordinary sensation that this particular robot is somehow alive. And that's precisely the point. Deep fakes. Seeing is not always believing, at least not in our age of deep fakes. Deep fakes come from deep learning technology, a type of machine learning that can replace a character from an original video with someone else by changing the new face onto a target. The result? Creepy, bizarre, and sometimes hilarious fake videos that look and sound just like real things. Simple software tools have now given the technology available to all. But as the technology improves and the deep fakes become even harder to detect, the dangers become even more declared, including election meddling and blackmail. We already got a comedy show running by ex-president Donald Trump from South Park's creators. How strange is that? Among every possibility, it removes our ability to believe our own eyes. This problem is far from being neglected, though. A new deep fake detection tool is said to expose the fakes 
with greater than 90% accuracy.